Willkommen zurück, liebe Leute, zu Metal Gear Solid 3. Wir sind das letzte Mal hier stehen geblieben und ähm, sollen ja jetzt... Ich glaube, hier sind wir nicht richtig. Wenn wir hier rein latschen, sind wir bestimmt nicht richtig. Wir sollen ja jetzt den ähm, Wasserfall aufwärts, den Fluss aufwärts, genau zum Wasserfall, so rum. Sollen wir ja gehen jetzt. Und äh, das machen wir doch mal. Da ist eine Schlange. Wer hat denn schon wieder... Hä? Wieso ist denn schon wieder die komplette Ausrüstung durcheinander? Wer war das denn jetzt? Was zur Hölle soll das? Was zur Hölle soll das? Jetzt mal ohne Witz. Ich kann gar nicht mal auf meinen Rucksack zugreifen. Ah. Hä? Okay. Ach so, ja, weil wir das geträumt haben. Ja, stimmt. Ja. <lacht> Aufpassen hier, nicht runterfallen. Nice to meet you, Snake. I'm Tatiana. Here's your equipment. Eva, you could use a towel. So could you. Want some? No, thanks. <clears throat> Don't like snakes? Not for dinner. Hmm. Didn't you have to eat them at the KGB? In my training, we always got the good stuff. French, Italian, that kind of thing. A regular Matahari. The least you could do is call me Cynthia. Tell me something. How does it feel to spy on your own country? I can't say it feels good, but it's my job. Can't even eat a snake during a mission, huh? I wouldn't mind eating you. When this mission's over, you'll have to treat me to a nice dinner. What do you want to eat? Let's see. How about sushi? Sushi? It's Japanese. I hear it's all the rage right now. Supposedly it's made from raw fish. Raw fish? Just the place for my survival techniques. <laughs> What a thrill. With darkness and 
Snake. Thank you, Snake. I'll be your eyes from now on. I'm searching and I'm melting to you. Are you all right? It's not like I can't see. I've got one good eye and can still fire a gun. Really? Good. Eva, didn't you steal some explosives out of the fortress? C3, a highly potent explosive from the West. It can be molded into any shape, like clay. With just this much, you could blow up the Shagohat and the lab along with it. Is that right? Yeah, but there's a trick to using it. Tell me about it. Well, what do you think? The Shagohad's booster unit uses liquid fuel. The fuel tanks are in the main wing of the weapons lab in the hangar housing the Shagohad itself. So I should blow up the tanks? That's the basic idea. It should be enough to blow up the entire hangar. There are four fuel tanks. In order to destroy the hangar, you'll have to set explosives on each of those tanks. All four of them? It should be no sweat for you. Besides, the scientists had the day off today. So the hangar's completely deserted. Not quite. They've still got guards posted there. So what do I do after I set the C3? The bombs run off a timer. Once the timer has been set, the countdown will begin. When the timer reaches zero, the bombs will all go off at once. How long do I have? 20 minutes. Once the Phase 2 trials are finished, I wouldn't be surprised if they kill all the scientists to prevent them from talking. So you've got to act fast. I'll take care of it. Eva, did you get the data on the Shagohod from Sokolov? Yeah. That's the mission I was given. By Khrushchev? Mm-hmm. America doesn't have any use for it, does it? Huh. But I haven't forgotten my other mission, either. Helping you out. <laughs> Follow this cave and go up the ladder at the end. You'll come out inside Groznygrad, just southwest of the weapons lab. Do you remember when you went to rescue Sokolov? Remember there was a locked door when you entered the main wing from the second floor of the east wing? Yeah. That's the entrance to the Shagohad's hangar. Use this key to open that door. The door right when I enter the main wing? Got it. What about you? I'll get things ready for our escape. There's a rail bridge to the north. I'm gonna set a bomb there, so I'm taking half of the C3 with me. Right. I'll set off the weapons lab then. Try not to be in the neighborhood when it happens. Gotcha. And watch out for Ocelot. He suspects you're not who you say you are. Don't worry. The Colonel still trusts me. And I have my ways. There's not a man alive who can resist my charms. Uh, Besides you, of course. I'm just warning you, Eva. That's all. I know. Okay, let's go. You seem like you were born on one of those. 
<laughs> if I didn't ride every day, I couldn't go on living. Huh? When I'm riding, the wind hits me so hard that it hurts. That pain keeps my mind off the pain of having to be someone else. It's not easy always fooling myself like this. It's only when I'm on the bike that I'm free to be the real me. I only get off my bike when I fall in love or fall dead. What's your name? Tatiana. No. Your real name. <laughs> What's wrong with Tanya? Uh, okay, Tanya. Don't let anyone see you. Huh? Oh, this? It's a button camera. What did you do that for? Insurance. To make sure you don't double-cross me. Ugh, yeah, snake in. <lacht> Was der doch für ein Glück hat, dass so eine äh, heiße Braut sich an seinen Hals wirft und er, ach, ich habe kein Interesse und bla, dann geh mal weg. Ja, ja, der Typ ist knallhart hier. Knallhart, sag ich euch. Ähm hier haben wir jetzt wieder unsere Tarnungen dabei, unsere Ausrüstung ist auch am Start wieder. Die ich jetzt auch anpassen muss nochmal. Oh, Alter, oh. Äh, Gabel weg, Überlebensmesse. Die Nebelgranate raus. Zack. C3 rein, normale Granate rein, okay, okay. Na gut. <lacht> Dann machen wir uns mal auf jetzt. Um endgültig diesen Shaggerhard kaputt zu machen. Zu zerstören. Ich bin gespannt. Auf jeden Fall sieht es ganz geil aus jetzt mir mit der Augenklappe. Jetzt kennt man ihn so. Wie man ihn kennt. <lacht> Was? Oh, Karton B haben wir gefunden. Ja, okay. Jetzt kennt man ihn so, wie man ihn kennt. Und kann es eigentlich sein? Das frage ich mich sowieso schon die ganze Zeit im Laufe des Let's Plays. Ich habe es also, noch nicht angesprochen, aber diese, dieser Mantel oder beziehungsweise dieser Poncho-artige Mantel halt von The Boss. Das ist doch genau der gleiche wie bei den Ground Zeros. Trailer, oder? Den sie da anhaben. Ocelot und der Boss. Ihr wisst schon, was ich meine.
Das war auf jeden Fall knapp. So, jetzt lass mal. Ist da ein Hund links? Das ist auch hier die beste Rüstung, äh, Tarnung. Da ist ein Hund tatsächlich. <lacht> Rambo! Mal gucken, ob ich jetzt da hochkomme. Äh, reinkomme, meine ich. Nee. Dann würde ich sagen, müssen wir wieder zurück zu diesem einen Gebäude, wo wir... Damals, damals, sag ich schon, wo wir uns die Dinge, die Tarnung geholt haben. Ich hoffe, es geht jetzt wieder, als wir das letzte Mal da vorbeigelatscht sind. Nach dem Ausbruch, da konnten wir ja da nicht reingehen. Ich weiß, ich weiß, es ist eigentlich viel zu einfach, was ich hier mache. Mit unendlich Munition und alles, das hast du nicht gesehen, das wissen wir aber mittlerweile. Ich werde mich jetzt hier auch wahrscheinlich einfach nur durchballern. Das ist, glaube ich, der schnellste Weg. Nein, falsche Seite ausgewählt. Nee, warte mal. Das war ja hier hinten, ne? Stimmt, den sind wir ja sogar richtig. Ich glaube, hier war die Tür. Jo. Snake, I see you've managed to sneak into the hangar. Yeah, the Shagahod's in here. The completed Phase II Shagahod represents a grave threat to the West. We can't allow it to be mass-produced. You've got to destroy it. Eva's got the data on the Shagahod. Do you think that's safe? Well, I wouldn't exactly say it's safe, but Khrushchev is a shrewd leader. I can't imagine he'd use it for anything other than deterrence. Volgin, however, is a different story. He's planning to use the Shagahod to turn the Cold War into a blazing hot one. We can't let him have it. Agreed. That leaves just one more mission for you to carry out. The boss. Exactly. Uh. For now, just focus on destroying the Shagahod. Yes, sir. I'll let Sigint fill you in on how to destroy it. Yo, like Eva was saying, if you're looking to blow the whole place sky high, the best way is to take out those liquid fuel tanks with the C3. You know there's four tanks in there, right? You have to put C3 on all four of them. To plan a C3 charge, all you gotta do is equip the C3 and press the weapon button while standing in front of a tank. Just like TNT. But uh, make sure you don't plant it in the wrong place. You barely got enough C3 as it is, right? Good point. I'll make sure not to plant it anywhere else. Good, man. And be careful. Liquid fuel has a nasty habit of going off at the slightest shot. So don't go using any heavy firepower near the tanks unless you're aiming to get yourself barbecued. I'll keep that in mind. The C3 charges all have to go off at once if you want to bring down the hangar in one fell swoop. So if I were you, I'd wait until after you plant the last charge to start the timer mechanism. All right. I'll make sure I finish planting all four charges before I start the timer. Once the timer's set, you've got 20 minutes until it explodes, right? So make sure you get your ass out of that place by then. I think that's about all I've got. The rest is up to you. Good luck, pal. We're counting on you, Snake. 
Oh Mann, ey. Oh Mann. Ähm. Ist das einer dieser? Nein, das ist keiner, ne? Da ist einer. Okay, Leute, was machen wir denn jetzt? Wachen die eigentlich auf? Die wachen auf irgendwo, ne? Stirbt ja nicht? Egal. Äh, Leute, ich würde sagen, wir machen das beim nächsten Mal. Sonst wird der Part viel zu lang. Ähm, ja, ich bedanke mich fürs Zusehen. Ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Bis zum nächsten Mal. Und tschüss.